was a Sunday, about 12 o'clock, I went to bed. But one o'clock, I wake up and I'm on the floor. I said, how the heck did I end up on the floor? And then I said, well, it's time to get up to go back into bed. And I couldn't get up. I didn't know how to walk. I had to crawl from my bedroom to my living room. It took me about uh, six or seven hours. We thought we were going to lose Paul. And in the moment, that was the biggest concern. The more therapy he received, the more we knew that he wasn't going to be able to go back to work. And his life was, was going to change. After having this stroke, uh, I couldn't walk or nothing. So they said, oh, you, you're going to have to be put in a home. But after being at rehab clinic, uh, I was there for about a month or so. And uh, after uh, I could walk, work with constant therapy and uh, find that it's a, a very helpful uh, device to uh, work with. I see a difference in Paul. His language is much clearer. He's much more fluid with his conversation. You use it uh, just about every day. And, uh, and I find it, uh, it an astounding program to uh, work with. People used to think once you had a stroke, you might not get any worse, but you're not gonna get any better. And this gives people hope and it's shown that it has had very positive results. So he's lucky you all exist <laughs> and care about him. I find it incredibly helpful in getting my uh, word ver verbiage and talking and thinking and uh, all around uh, capabilities. I say, don't give up and don't get upset, life will improve, and don't worry.